Right here I have this three piece photography background board and this is going to make like a window shadow. I'm gonna go ahead and open this up and show you what the pieces look like and kind of how I might use them. This is everything that came inside the box. We have these three different window style panels which I think are gonna be really cool. We do have little spots right here if you do have to hang them depending on what type of location you're using or if you're clipping them up more like this for example. And it does come with four different little stands. So you could use two stands for two different ones at the same time, for example. I do feel like this one kind of gives the simulation more of like blinds. This one gives the simulation of a window kind of from sideways. So the light's looking in sideways a little bit. And this one is more of a standard window frame look to it. I'm gonna go ahead and move my light right here just so you can get an idea of kind of how these work. So before I show you how these work, these are actually made out of high quality PVC. So you can kind of see this thick plastic type material. So I do like that they're a little bit more durable. You can keep these and continue to use them over and over. These are also waterproof, so if they do get wet, you don't have to worry about that. And just for size reference, these are 15 inches by 19 inches. So let me go ahead and set up that light. So I have some flowers right here, just as an example, and I dimmed my large, really bright light, and I'm just using this small light. Obviously, you can use this however works best with you. If you have studio lighting and special lighting effects, that would obviously work a little bit better, but I'm just working with what I have. So I just wanted to show you how, kind of what the difference makes between using some of these different pieces here. So if you have your product right here, for example, I have some flowers in a little vase. I just have a regular little lamp behind here. And if I take this little sideways window piece and put it in front of here, you can kind of see how it makes these window lines on the ground or on the countertop. So you can see as you adjust the actual simulator right over here, you can adjust kind of how the window panes fall on the item that you're picturing. This would be perfect if you're taking pictures of something like a product or jewelry, something like that could be really cool. So you can see you kind of have that window pane look on here. And let me go ahead and grab the one that simulates more of a blinds look. So let's pull this one right over here and obviously you can adjust the lighting however you see fit. You can just adjust this according to even your outdoor lighting. You can make the lines longer or shorter. I do really like that it has these little stands on here just so you can move them as you feel like you need to. Okay, I'm gonna go grab the last window pane shaped one. All right, I have this basic window shaped one with regular looking window panes. And so you can just adjust this according to however you want your light to hit it. Overall, I love all three of these options. I think that it'd be really fun to play with your photography with these. I like how durable they are. I love that they're waterproof. They're easy to carry with you. They don't take up a lot of space and they're super lightweight, which makes it really handy to use them.